Rainbow Factory? Ugh, I hate that hippie junk. This is going to be the worst school play ever. So why do you want to be in it? I don't want to be in the play. I want to do lights and sound. Yeah, because that'll be much cooler. Have you seen that controller console? It has like a million buttons. It's on my bucket list. Why do you have a bucket list? You'll never kick the bucket. It's a long list. And item 12 says star in the school play. So I can ram it in the face of that pint-sized drama queen, Sunday Clovers. You act like she came all the way from Australia on exchange just to bother you. Well, why can't you just be nice? Don't tell me how to live, Sarah. I just don't want you making lightning and burning everyone's hair off. Again. Eyebrows don't count as hair. Age before beauty. Oh, that's it. Let the eagles of creativity soar. I'm off to make copies of this wonderful script. <laughs> Looks like it doesn't want to open. It didn't want to be found either. Hiding away inside that basement wall for 25 years and I stuck it out. <laughs> oh, there we go. Should be clear sailing from here. <laughs> The sun warms the lake with her love. She smiles the water to the sky. It falls back down to the ground to hug every flower and every tree. You were very present. Congratulations, Sunday Clovers. You're our lead. <laughs> Do I dream, or do my waking eyes see color anew? Such reds, such golds, ah, to see my joy. <gasps> Thank you so much, Miss Lofthouse Oldman Little. Oh, the kids call me Miss LOL. <laughs> Makes me want to put that little shrimp on the barbie. I know you'll be a real ace understudy, and you'll step right in if something happens to me. Yes, if something happens to you. <laughs> Wow, you have a lot of positive energy. I can feel it in my ribs. <laughs> I'm grinning like a shot fox. I'm gonna do the Harold Holt and have a cat and cook at my dressing room. What just happened? Oh, and Sarah, I know you'd be a perfect fit for Sundrop's best friend, Rainbeam. I was just helping Erica out. Wasn't trying out myself. What a shame, you're a natural. Down to the ground to hug every flower and every tree. The water cycle is truly a cycle of love. Sorry, cycle of love. Really? <laughs> because I actually had so much fun doing it. And the part about the bunnies that wolf each other, so cute. I'll take that as a big yes. Good luck acting like you can stand Sunday Clovers. La, 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 la. Who needs to suffer? What? But I don't want to hurt anyone. Hey, Ethan. Check this out. 
My new prank video just hit a million views. <laughs> Classic pranksy. I'm super popular. Wait, you're pranksy? The guy who paints people's faces? Yep. And nobody knows it. <laughs> Suckers. Well, technically, if nobody knows, then you're not really popular. Ah, but but I'm pranksy. Yeah, but nobody knows that. Oh no. People need to know I'm awesome. I gotta get on this. Ethan, this script rots. There's no lightning, no thunder, nothing even close to an explosion. I know. Here it's ran full of feelings and believing in yourself. Benny believes in lightning. You gotta sign up and help me out with this. No way. I am not a drama nerd. I am a real nerd. Sarah's in it. I'm a drama nerd. When I was a little girl, I dreamed about being a movie star. Kinda hard now since I can't show up on camera. But the last two weeks have been so much fun. Oh, no. And a great now. escape from... Uh, sorry. You don't have to listen to all this. No, 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 no. Go on. That's what stage managers are for. I think. You're the star. They didn't treat you like one and they have to pay. It's time to break a leg. Rainbeam needs to help Sundrop believe in loving herself so she can apply for the job of Mother Nature. Can you put that in your heart? I got it. Okay, good. All right, where's our star? We have to get cracking. The sun drops down. <laughs> so the grasses can grow. <gasps> oh, ouch! My hands! That is why the sun drops down! Sunday? I'm okay. No, no worries. Uh, we need a doctor. And an understudy. Wait, can't vampires go all puppet master and the weak-minded? You could have convinced her to hurt herself. Glamouring is only something old and powerful vampires can do. So what did you do? Nothing. That Aussie punk is as mad as a cut snake. She freaked out on me earlier. Told me to stay out of her mirror. If I was going to break her legs, I'd have done it then. I think she's telling the truth. I am. Now, your star has lines to learn. We open tomorrow. No time to yabber like a dill. I think you're spending a little too much time as Sunday's understudy. Ah, uh, she's Apples. Now on your bike before I go aggro on your bako. <gasps> what? How can I have a reflection? I don't believe it. I'm so hot. I'm gonna look awesome under that spotlight. There isn't going to be any spotlight for anyone. Your father is on a team building trip for his work. And he sent us this cake that his team built. So, we're going to record ourselves loving it and send him the video. Okay. And if it makes you sick, I owe you one, okay? Got it. So, how... How's the play going? Um, well, our star kind of had 100 pounds of sandbags fall on her today. Really? You know, when I was at your school, a rainbow fell on a girl's head on opening night. A rainbow? <gasps> Was the play called Rainbow Factory? Yeah, I think it was. We're doing the same play. Really? Well, that would be a fun coincidence. If two girls didn't get hurt. I think we might want to record your sister loving this cake. Jane! It's morning for my feelings. Rainbeam, where are you? Look to the sky, Sundrop, where happiness spreads her wings. <laughs> Get it? Don't upstage me. Ever. 
or else. What? What's wrong with you? I was just playing. This is my show. Mine. No one else can have it. Your show? You're sounding just as bad as Sunday. Look at yourself. Oh. You can look at yourself. You have a reflection. Stay out of my mirror. Stay out of my way. Dude, how safe do you think it would be to have a flamethrower on stage? On a scale of pretty safe to completely safe. Pretty safe, I guess. You never think my ideas are safe. Are you even listening to me? What? You're searching theater curses on the web? Dude, relent. Uh, look, 25 years ago, the star of the Rainbow Factory, Olivia Fry, was the victim of a horrible accident in our theater on opening night. And now our star is flattened by sandbags. Yeah, but not horribly. We're cool. Right? Dudes, you got to see this. I'm sick of people not knowing I'm pranksy, so I went all truth crazy and posted this before school. Hey, I'm a name, pranksy. So now that name has a face. Recognize. You don't show up on camera, bud. No, I don't, but I thought Pranksy would. Dude, Pranksy is the subversive voice of our time. I'm, no one instantly paints faces like he does. How dare you try and take credit for his genius. But I'm Pranksy. Ethan, I need your help. Ethan, I need your help. Um, yeah. <laughs> oh. Sorry, man. Stage manager business. <laughs> oh, ow. Benny doesn't help posers. How dare you defy the great pranks? Hey! Pranksy strikes again. Erica attacked me. She was acting like I'd done something to her. This is going to sound crazy, but I saw her reflection in the mirror. I knew it. I told Benny this play was cursed. Maybe I'm right. Yeah, let's hope. Look, we need to go see that mirror. I'll go. Maybe you should avoid Erica. So, you don't think I could take her? Actually, I do. One second. There. Benny and I made a chart, like they do for cage fighters. See, you're quicker, but Erica's got the reach. And she's a little stronger. But I think you would win because you're not afraid to get hit in the face. Go. Uh, okay. Erica? Everything looks good. Maybe a little too good. This play is mine. They need to hurt for what they did. This play is mine? Where'd that come from? Bleed and pass out again? Oh, hey. Go. Oh. Hi. Where is everyone? How long was I out? Weird. Where am I watching my left hand? Y you, you could see me. No one sees me. You were in the mirror. 
Who are you? I'm Ethan. Is it ready? Good. I am going to work my way to dream and ride the rainbow. <laughs> they weren't trying to hurt you. It was supposed to be a joke. You wanted me to look stupid. Now, you're all gonna pay. All of who? My friends didn't do anything. Someone's in my mirror. Why do I have to wait? I can wipe them out right now. No, I have to suffer in front of everyone. And so will they. Everyone trusts their reflection. It's opening night. Do you want to help me run lights? Geek and his gizmos. You seem happy. But that'll change. Check it out, Bitey. Magic plus buttons equals star power. Like actual bright as a star power. Kind of the best, right? All these techno toys seem fragile to me. Betty! I'm, I'm sorry. It won't happen again. <laughs> I hope. Erica, what's wrong with you? Just leave me alone. Uh, that's not the Erica I know. Yeah, that's kind of the Erica I know. Did Ethan say if anything weird was going on with that mirror? No, I haven't seen him all day. Should I be as worried as you look? Okay, so vampires don't have a reflection because their curse blocks the soul's inner light. So if Erica saw herself, that means there's a soul inside this mirror. Hey, I'm getting pretty good with the stick, huh? Okay. There's someone inside, but I can't tell if it's Ethan. There's only one way to find out. They deserve to hurt all of them. Uh, Benny, it's Ethan. Get, Get me out of here. here. Touch the mirror and pull me through. Dude, I'm on it. Sarah, you have to touch the mirror. Ethan needs a supernatural connection. Spell that can unleash it. Just do it! Energy. Email me the explanation. Okay, here we go. Sakharov. Mass Nakarov. Hey. Teamwork for the win. Thanks. Get away from my mirror! Erica, watch out. What are you doing? That's seven years bad luck. Well, I guess I'll just have to shower with your grandma's special soap again. Erica, are you okay? Of course I'm okay. I'm finally free. Stronger than ever. I think I'll start the show with the finale. <laughs> Should we be terrified by that? No time to explain. There was a ghost girl trapped in the mirror. Now she's inside Erica. We gotta stop her before she gets revenge on everyone. For someone with no time to explain, you did a good job. Okay. Good evening, everyone. Welcome to the Whitechapel High production of The Rainbow Factory. I'm so excited. My son is the stage manager. I hope you enjoy an evening of warmed hearts and uplifted spirits. And I hope nobody ends up in the hospital. Oh, and again, I'm so sorry. My own fault. I did go a bit Billy Bonkers. But now it's Erica's turn to really make Sundrop shine. Okay. <laughs> you tried to stop me. But the show must go on. <laughs> Heads up, hippie. <laughs> I don't understand why all these shows nowadays have to have vampires in them. That's our babysitter.
Predator. Safety is off. Lightning is on. It's Penny time. My stage! Olivia! Fix uh, your hair! Uh, now, Betty! Libor! Hello! her for good and let her move on. Catch and release, huh? Very eco-friendly. Oh, well. It was nice to have a reflection while it lasted. Yeah, it was nice for you. The rest of us nearly died. Ah, oh, come on. We had a pretty great opening. Is Miss Sellowell still apologizing to everyone? Children are creative, <laughs> but uh, like a car license, a creative license can sometimes lead to a stupendous crash. <laughs> stupendous, but beautiful. Especially since no one was hurt. I'm reminded of Persephone's famous parting words to Prince Lucan in the play. Pranksy is revealed! Pranksy? I love him! Rory, you've got three weeks' attention. 